it's now like this instead of like <laughs> this. You understand? Uh, no, really. Now, what do you mean? Now it's like this instead of uh, like this. <laughs> you understand? That's that's how I'm confused. People, people think when you're in the US, you've made it. Too much money everywhere, like collecting here, yeah, putting in the bag, yeah, something like that. But so, it's not like that. Yeah. So for anybody watching this who's thinking about opening a YouTube channel, what can Mawa share with us for free right now? More views means at least there will be more subscribers, at least you can make more money, at yes. least you can, something like that. Some people even do YouTube who are haters, so imagine all the time they hate it, but still they have followers. That's true. <laughs> so that means you can, you can be anything on YouTube. All right. Yeah. So guys, welcome to Washington DC. I'm here with Ayamawa. He's visiting the city for the second time. Yes, I feel I feel like home. You know, I don't feel like uh, I'm new here. Yeah. Because I remember the first time I was walking alone doing live streams. We did several live streams that day. Yeah. So it's not the f uh, it's not the second time for me to be in the city. Yeah. But uh, in terms of traveling, it's my second season. Okay. Because I've been in this city like maybe 10, 15 times. Right. With you actually. Right. Right. But now like. This time round is yes. another new year. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Actually, I was here last year, probably. Right. Yes. Is there? Do you guys have a, an imposing government building in Nairobi? What does your government look like if someone goes and visit? How is it organized? So we have there? like a parliament stuff in the middle of the city. Yeah. Yeah. But this one is something else. Especially the way you see these buildings built. Here, yes. It just shows power. Yeah. So it shows just power. It shows seriousness. Yeah. Yeah. Now we just came back from New York. Yeah. And personally, I find DC kind of slow yeah. compared to New York. Well, what, yeah, do you, what, what, what are you thinking? It's more chill here. You don't see people. New York, it's like this. <laughs> no, that's true. But yeah. look how people are walking here. Look, they are standing. Yeah, here. yeah, yeah. Maybe it's because it's the end of the day. Right. People are getting out of work, so they are feeling tired. Right. I would love to see them, especially early in the morning. Right. Hi, there's the rush hour. Yes, the rush hour. Yeah. You know? Right behind you is the U.S. Supreme Court. That's the most important court here in the U.S. Yeah, right remember, there with the I two people. I, I don't know why now. I feel like... Uh, like you, you've been here. Yeah, but I, you know what I feel? I feel like it's now like this instead of like this. You understand? Uh, no, really. Now, what do you mean? Now it's like this instead of uh, like this. You understand? <laughs> that's, that's how I'm confused. From the bearing where we are coming from. Oh, oh. those are people here. What's going on? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like this, guys. There's a lot of people here in DC right now. I'm not quite sure what's going on. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys kind of like the vibe right here, right now. For those of you who've never been here, right in front of us is the U.S. Capitol. All right, and then you have the House of Representative on the right, and then you have the Senate on the left, or the other way around. I'm not actually sure exactly which which side they are on. But you have, it's divided in two, you have the U.S. Senate and then you have the, the House of Representatives. So, as you can see, you have a tremendous amount of people here. No, I feel like it's a tour, like uh, maybe people came from a country to tour U.S. Or yeah, something. it's possible. Like yeah, maybe it's possible. like a U.N. something meeting. And... Yeah. If I come visit Kenya, right, can I actually get inside one of the government buildings and visit? No. No. No filming the whole arrest. <laughs> you go and touch the door. I touched these doors before. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's very different. Yeah. It's very, very different. America is very different. Yeah. And that's the that's the typical thing in Africa, you know, people are not allowed to go visit Anything, the government buildings, you know. People are so suspicious. Yes. Here people walk, they yeah, go inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even in Europe, I went to I went nearly to the parliament, European Parliament like yes. inside. You're yeah. told, just, just go. Yeah. And with us in Africa, man, restrictions after restrictions, you can't. You, who are you? Come here before you say it. You already roughed it down. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. All right. I feel this is like a college, and it's good. Yeah, they look they look fairly young, right? I think they were touring um, the Library of Congress, actually. Oh. The Library of Congress is over there. It's a really build beautiful building. I'm not gonna take you there because it's like a museum. And just so you guys know, Mawa is not really a fan of museums. No, I don't do museums. I want something new. <laughs> new, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can yeah. Google museum and see what is inside. That's right, yeah. that's right. Yeah. <laughs> All right. But I'm a history guy. I'm not saying I'm not a history guy. Yeah. But it's not my thing. It's not your thing. Yeah. I like something totally unorganized. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah, these are students. They are wearing even oh, same. They have even their teachers. Yeah. If you don't film them, they may give you problems. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. No, just so you understand, in the U.S., you have the right to film in public. Oh. Anything that's public, you can film. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, I've seen I've seen videos actually. Yeah. I've seen videos of uh, people filming even police. Yeah, in public you can film yes. anything you want. It's not a problem. Wow. Yeah. That's a very good law, you know. Mm -hmm. Because what, otherwise, this is not private. No. Yeah. There's already cameras on us right now, anyway. Yeah, yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I think that's, that's why they they allow that true law. We can go. We can go. Yeah, okay. Two, 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 All right. So he's gonna start vlogging, and I'm gonna take you guys in the in the ground. So. Right in front of us, you have the U.S. Capitol. All right, that's what you have right there. And as I was pointing out, you can get a better view. That is the United States Supreme Court. It's yeah. your second time here. Yeah. How do you feel, man? Here you are back in the U.S. Capitol, Mawa. Yeah. Man, the world is controlled from this area. Yeah. Like, how magical is this space? Yeah. Yeah. Like the entire world. Right. They decide. War in Ukraine, no war. They decide everything. You understand? <laughs> like yes. it's, it's deep to come yes. to realize that. Yeah. And uh, but apart from that, it should be a scary place. But when you look at people, people are just chilling, taking pictures. Yes. You yes. know, it should be me and not like FBI would be here trying to protect, protect, protect. Yeah. And that's the funny thing about America. Once you go inside America, everything looks like local. Right. You, you, even it doesn't hit that you are in America. You know when you're out there, people are so like, yes. They're looking for American visa. Yeah. Oh, will they give you? Really? Yeah. You know, things like that. What do Kenyans think of the U.S. in general? I know you can't speak for the whole country, but the people you know, like your mom, who've never been here, yeah. D, and all these other people. People think when you're in the U.S., you've made it. Too much money everywhere, like collecting here. Yeah. Putting in the bag. Yeah. Something like that. But so, it's not like that. Yeah. So uh, what are the village people like uh, the people that work build your house? What do they ask? What are they curious about? Like you visit here? Yes, super say? surprised. Like a guy like me coming to America. Yeah. Like I, like now I was with them. I was telling you this story the other day. Like it's a big statement for a guy like me to be mingling with very many of my friends back in the village, yes. like locals. Yeah. Like for example, my masons. Mm -hmm. Then in like a week's time, they see me in America. Yeah. It's a huge statement. It's yeah. like. Man, look, we were with this guy, now he's in America. Yeah. Like boss, they called me boss in, back in my village. Yeah. So they say boss is in America, like, yeah. you know? Yeah. That gives them a lot of hope and, and also tells them everything is possible. So you yeah. guys walked around the capital just to show Mawa what it looks like around here. This is the second time that he actually visits this place. So it's still- We took the, some pictures for Instagram. Yeah. So guys, you can check us on Instagram right there. We that's just want right. to show you where the world is ruled from. Right. And that's just amazing, man. Yeah. Just, yeah. It shows mighty, like roads are going underground, <laughs> like that one. <laughs> and up here we are just walking. Yeah, man. Yeah. Hey, it is what no, it is. It's nice to have you back in DC, man. Hey. Oh. You know, I, I can't trust anything I'm stepping here. I'm like, is there a secret door? <laughs> you know? Yeah. 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 Sounds good. No, it's good to have you here, man. I mean, personally, yes. you know, of course, like you said, there's a lot more uh, action in New York. Yeah. So I, as a native, I'm not, you know, guys, don't kill me for this, but I think this is boring compared to New York. But that's yeah, just me. Yeah, but the thing is, to be here is okay. Because, uh, you know, for you, it should be boring because it's home. And every day you are here, nothing new. You that's you've right. You've seen these buildings for many, many years. Yeah. But a guy like me, it's a statement to my village boys. Like, <laughs> yeah, look, if you work hard, you could be chilling next to Biden. Yeah. You know? Right. You no, know, Biden is breathing the same air as I'm breathing right now. Yeah. But even from Kenya, yeah. he's still breathing the same air. Yeah, the you. same air. That's the thing. But now, what I'm trying to say is, we are very close. Yeah, yes, yeah. That's my point. For sure, for sure. All right, all right. So that's what it is, guys. I, I want to share more, but there's not much. This is a typical day after work. People are just basically, um, you know, walking back to the metro and finishing up their day. All these workers are here, you know, just going home. Yeah. So that's what's going on. We are on the northeast side of washington dc here yeah and that's we're gonna go court. yeah that's do you still want to go to the supreme court or you want to go to the uh, second section we're going to visit today no actually i think we are late because you remember i have a date at six yes so we have a few minutes to see so you want to go home we're going to go to the place okay. not home so guys now i'm home with ayamawa i uh we we had a drive to come down here about four hours we we're lucky not to hit traffic 
we just woke up this morning and we were doing some uh, live, not live stream, what is this thing called again? Premiere. We were doing premieres for both Mawa's video and mine. And I'm learning so much about thumbnails and everything. So I want to talk to him about first his time here so far. And then without giving away any of his secrets, uh, that's going to be part of his uh, masterclass. Awesome. Just some tips for anybody watching this who's thinking about opening a YouTube channel. What can Mawa share with us for free right now? So how are you doing today, man? Good morning. Good. Hey, good morning. Maybe I'll do it from this yes. because of the light. Yes. Or you want to come? Yeah, let's this go. Side. Yeah, you want to go outside? No, I mean you. Bring oh, this, this way. Okay. Of the light. You Perfect. see now how it looks yes. really different. So how are you doing today, man? Good morning. Hey, good morning, guys. First is I'm rocking with Amara Soft Life. This is my clothes brand. I'm very proud of it, and um, I'm just doing very great. We are at Ivan's place. I will be here for a while. We are trying to. I'm trying to process some visas yeah. for the next countries. So in DC, I've never processed visas from here. I've done from San Francisco. Mm -hmm. But let me try this time around. So what was your question again? Anybody watching this yeah. who is thinking about opening a YouTube channel without yeah. giving all your secrets away, yeah. what are some of the advice you can give to any up-and-coming YouTuber out there? The thing is, uh, YouTube is just a game of numbers. You post more videos, you see more success. Mm -hmm. I did statistics in my university, and all it says is the bigger the sample space, Mm -hmm. the accurate the value you get mm -hmm. sample space in this case is let's say you want to know how many people like chocolate and mm -hmm. how many people like hot chocolate and coffee for example mm -hmm. versus coffee so the more people you choose the more accurate answer you get mm -hmm. but if you choose just three people maybe one will say i don't like another one but if you choose 300 mm -hmm. you really understand 50 people chose this this so you can have a very kind of precise and correct answer. Mm -hmm. Same scenario goes to YouTube. The more videos you post, the more you grow as a person, the more accurate you understand YouTube, mm -hmm. the more accurate you, you... You actually, you see the numbers. For example, let's say even people don't watch you. Only 10 people watch you. Mm -hmm. But in a week, you post one video. Mm -hmm. Another person... Uh, only 10 people also watches him. But in a week, he posts at least every day one video mm -hmm. so in a week you, you have 10 videos but me who i'm posting every day i have 10 times 7 mm -hmm. that is 70 views mm -hmm. yes i mean i meant views not videos yes so you can imagine so you having 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 more videos is bringing more views which can translate to success in any other way because yes. more views means at least there will be more subscribers. At least you can make more money. At yes. least you can, something like that. Starting a brand new channel, how many videos should someone release every week? Brand new channel. Brand new channel uh, is at least not less than seven videos a week. Wow. Meaning you can release two videos a day mm -hmm. or three videos a day. Because nobody knows you, so it's not like you're bombarding people there with a lot of videos. Yes. It's not like me, you know, now, Maro, if I put one video out, that's okay. Mm -hmm. But I can press myself and put two, that's one in the morning and one in the evening, which is not my way. Yes. But if, let's say I'm traveling so much and I have to put videos out, I put them that way. Yes. So the best thing I'm trying to say is uh, when you're starting, you have no, no limited or limitations to the number of videos you can post. Right. So what do you say to people who are camera shy? They feel like they are too big, not attractive enough, or... They just have some, uh, you know, issues with showing themselves on camera. Everybody has issues. Everybody. Uh, even, even I don't know, princess. I don't know who princess. Who even the, the one who won uh, Miss Universe this year. Mm -hmm. You talk to them, they have issues about their body mm -hmm. or the way they look or mm -hmm. something they don't like. It could yes. be even an ear. It could be I don't know, so or forehead. Yes. Everybody has an issue. Those who will love you will love you. Mm -hmm. And YouTube, even mostly, it's not about how you appear. It's it's the personality. It's yes. what the vibe you bring to the audience. Mm -hmm. That's what actually is the most important. You mm -hmm. know, yes. Mm -hmm. Some people even do YouTube who are haters. So imagine all the time they hate, hate, but still they have followers. That's true. <laughs> so that means you can you can be anything on YouTube. All right. Yes. Well, thank you. Welcome back again to Maryland. And yes, uh, guys, Ivan is hosting me here. If you've seen my video, uh, this is Ivan's space. Uh, if he has time, he will show you his space. Yeah. But uh, welcome again. It's my second time. Second time here or Second time. Second time. Oh, wow. 
Yeah. yeah. Second, I feel like this has been home. I feel like I've been here like five times. Yeah, and you have a lot of supporters here too. So yeah. we do need to put the message out, you know, for anybody in the DC area. I'm gonna talk to Mawa about organizing a meet and greet. Yeah, that's true. So that he can say hello to as many people because I, I get a lot of messages from people saying, especially over the weekend. Man. Yeah, awesome. give me Mawa's number, and I can't. I'm I can't give his phone number out. You know, mm -hmm. he doesn't want me to share his number. And uh, he doesn't want to be bombarded with more messages than he's already getting, guys. So yeah. I'm sorry I can't do that. But we're going to organize a meet and greet so most people can, uh, you know, can get a chance to meet him directly. All right, Mawa, welcome back to the DMV. All right, guys. All right. Thank you, guys. All right. Subscribe, subscribe to this YouTube channel. So we're getting ready to go eat. And I'm going to take him to this Kenyan restaurant. And it's an amazing, amazing place. I love that food over there, man. It's my favorite restaurant in the area. So I'm going to take Mawa over there and you're going to hear his feedback about what is Kenyan food taste like in America versus in Kenya. So let's go. So this is uh, the menu. And I want Mawa to maybe, maybe talk about some of the items that you see here. Does that look like traditional things that you will find in Kenya? Mokimo is the most like typical total African food you can find. All right. So guys, I can't begin to tell you how delicious this food is. It's so good that Mawa is already saying that he wants to come back here. Isn't that right? After two days for sure. <laughs> 